Good morning, it's Thursday 13th of January 2011. I'm Tom Elliott and this is my market report. Well overnight the uh, Dow Jones index had a pretty substantial rise, up uh, 80 odd points which is 0.7 of 1%. Commodity prices have started to head up again and that's partly due to what's happening with the floods here in Australia. Coal prices are going up, steel prices are going up because of the shortages that are going to be caused out of Queensland. This is actually of course good for those parts of the Australian economy which aren't directly affected by the floods. What we're also seeing as well as some of the panic early in the week, well not panic, but people selling down insurance stocks appears to have been overdone. Most of the big listed insurance companies, IAG, QBE and so forth, have actually said that their, their flood cover is pretty minimal. They haven't insured against floods up in Queensland especially for quite some time. So the direct impact to those companies' profits of the Queensland floods is actually not too great. As a result, uh, share prices in all the listed insurance companies up quite strongly this morning. Bank share prices are up. Again, there were fears that mortgage delinquencies would be on the rise, but the reality is that Queensland is only around about 18-19% of the overall economy. So the direct effect on the big banks, which have coverage of course all over Australia, relatively minimal. Uh, BHP, Rio and Fortescue all up as well. Two reasons there. I've already mentioned commodity prices going up. That's obviously good for them. But secondly, the Australian dollar has been a bit weak the past few days. Uh, the fact that people are seeing uh, huge queues of, of unloaded coal ships off our coast means that the uh, the revenue that we would normally expect to get from exports at this time of year uh, may not be coming in for quite some time. So this has been a bit negative for the A dollar. A week ago it was 102.40 US. Right now it's about 99.4 US cents and was actually a whole cent lower this time yesterday. So at the moment the share market is now slightly up for January. It was down up until yesterday. Um, I still reckon volatility is going to be the order of the day. There are still grave fears about what's happening with with, uh, the European debt situation, in particular with Portugal, which keeps saying it doesn't need a bailout, it doesn't need a bailout, and uh, to cynical investors this is code for saying actually we probably think we do need a bailout fairly soon. However, the US economy appears to be on the improve and that's the reason share prices are up as we speak.